me to think. That leaves the go go as my current go. I hate that. I mean, Capricorn is one of Lucy's most reliable spirits, but so's Leo. Alright, I'm not gonna delay the inevitable, though. I could just stop and grind or something. But no. Don't mind me just roll skating upstairs. I'm a rebel like that. All right. I we got a Serena fight sometime soon too. And that's just glorious. Not Serena, uh, Calum. Callum? What's his face? Oh yes, yeah, Rock Climb. One of the more annoying HM moves. Man, there were a lot of normal type HM moves at one point. Cut, strength, uh, rock climb. Defog was flying type. That's one of the reasons why I kind of accept some of the big changes they made in later Pokemon games. Because HMs are quite the challenge. You really risk having good moves and stuff for having something that lets you do stuff in the field. And if they were all optional, like cuts optional in this game, it would be something different. But, oh god dang it. Counter for a fighting type. That was a mistake. Because Lapras isn't going to outspeed that thing. Ah yes, the power of goat milk. How have they not missed? This is this is glorious. RNG is like allergic to helping me out in this game. Good riddance with you. Are you kidding me? I should have potioned.
admit, this is just an unlucky stream. Was like cursed by a hex maniac or something? I can't even get that item because of where she ended up being. Man, we're not even going to make it to the Elite Four at this rate. Area disparity is kind of distracting. When you go from one route like that, and it's not really. I guess this isn't as heavily snowy, so it's like the edge of the snow. It's still kind of odd, though. Thank you for the POV shot, for whatever reason. He was, he was really helpful. The both of them were. Hmm. I'm sorry, this is just pretty demoralizing. I think this might be the toughest late game I've had in one of my Pokemon runs. I, like, this is very low on the death count. compared to the other runs, but they're all coming up at the end, and that's kind of scary. Okay, there goes Zorark. Another member that would have been a huge help. That wasn't even to a trainer, that was to a wild. This is just some hardcore mass destruction I'm dealing with here. Bebe, 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 bebe. Sorry, persona joke. I'll tell you when you're older. I'm not talking to anyone right now. There's, it says there's someone watching, but they ain't in the chat and there's no one here that you guys can't hear. I said you guys again. Oh boy, that is, that's a lot of gate keys shattered. I have an idea. It's desperate and dumb. 
But hey, I'm desperate and dumb. God, this is thing's gonna be so low level. It's gonna be basically worthless, even with the bonuses. But if I stick a lucky egg on it and keep it in the back seat, it might do some good in the future. But I'm getting close to the danger zone. If I run into a situation where a HM Pokemon can no longer get shattered, I'd have to go find another one to do that. So if Aquarius goes down, I need to go find another Aquarius, and that could just be a huge issue. You're what, level 30? <laughs> 32. Give you the lucky egg that should make a noticeable dent in the level difference. What do you have? It's... <sighs> Not the best moves. Why can you learn Solar Beam, lady? What's your stat distrib looking like? You're fast. Playing on a 3DS? Uh, no, I'm using Citra to emulate. I don't have a capture card on a 3DS mushroom. Let's see. Oh, okay, cool. Yep. Yeah, it's kind of cool. I'm glad I'm able to do this so I can actually play one of these games on stream. Let's see, is there some trick? Poison type, but for coverage sake, that's probably a good call. Uh, 